Howdy y'all, DJTJ here, back with some more AOS on tabletop sim uh, tips. Uh, this is the second video of the series, it's going to be a short video. Pretty much going to cover what you need to play uh, AOS on tabletop simulator and sort of how to get uh, the the software installed. I'm not going to go in depth on this, so if you need to learn how to install software and stuff, um, there's other, plenty of other videos that will help you with that. I'm just going to give you a brief overview on how you sort of get Tabletop Simulator from the Steam Workshop. Um, if that is no use to you because you already have Tabletop Simulator or you're pretty tech savvy, you can skip this video. It's probably not going to help you that much. Alright, so the first thing I want to talk about is what what do you need to play um, as far as your computer and everything? to play tabletop simulator and AOS on here. Well, you'll need your, a computer, a PC of some sort, laptop, desktop, whatever. If you have a work computer or a gaming rig, it will run tabletop simulator. I have noticed that tabletop simulator is especially running some of the AOS games. It's not super optimized, so when you get it, you would need to turn your settings down. Um, other than a computer, you would need an internet connection. So, if you're just going to download the game, it could be a really slow connection. And if you're just going to play by yourself or use it, something like that. However, if you are going to play with other people, and especially if you're going to stream and use Discord and other things, you will need a pretty good internet connection. You will need Steam or another service to download the game. Uh, most gamers, most people have Steam. Um, so we'll talk about that a little bit in a second. Um you will need to purchase this game. It'll cost about $20 unless it's on sale. You'll need Discord or another chat service, and I'm not really going to go into that. There is a built-in chat function in Tabletop Simulator. I don't really ever use it. We just sort of use Discord. There's um, many, many, many different voice over IP, different chat things that you can use. Whatever you and the people you're playing are comfortable with, um, I suggest Discord personally, but it's whatever is up to you. And you will need a microphone and speaker slash headset. Um, if you are going to play another person, it is very important that you have a way to communicate with each other because if you were just typing in the chat all your moves, that would just take a long time. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and exit out of here. So if you do not have... Steam downloaded on your computer. You can launch your web browser and type in steampower.com into the search engine or store.steampower.com. Up here in the search bar, well, after you, you would make your account, install Steam, make an account, um, then you can search up any game you want. I honestly, um, you know, if you're one of those that are worried about is this a safe site, is this something good to do, I've had no trouble using Steam for. 13 or probably even going close to 15 years now um, it's safe thousands and thousands of gamers use it all the time it's a legitimate company so make an account install steam and then when you launch it it'll look very similar to this you can type in the game you're looking for and in this case we're going to type in tabletop simulator notice if you type in table it's the first one that comes up and you can go ahead and click on that when you go here, you can add to cart and make the purchase. Um, if you're unsure, again, about Tabletop Simulator, this is another great place to look. You can come down to the bottom, and there's reviews, and people will talk about the game in general. Reddit's another place to um, to go and check You know how good is Tabletop Simulator, um, should I purchase it. And then you can add it to cart and go through the payment process, download it, and install it. Once again, like I said, I'm not covering all those things because that's pretty universal and there's plenty of videos online that can show you how to download and install games from Steam. Now, once you have it installed, you can make a desktop icon or you can simply run it from your Steam account. Um, I like to put icons. And then you just double click it to launch. And there you have it. That is a very, very quick, basic overview of 
how you get Tabletop Simulator from Steam, get it downloaded. And now, once you get to this point, you can go to video number three, and we'll talk about how we set up AOS in it. Thanks for watching.